Taylor, I'll come to you first. Am I right in perceiving that the political parties are all blurring into one, that it's becoming harder and harder to tell the difference? To a certain extent, you're right. But I think there are people out there with vision. I think the media loves to look at the bad side rather than the good side. There's a glass of water in front of me on that table. I see that glass as half full, not half empty. Who are the visionaries? I think probably the younger generation. A true leader is a healer who brings people together. I hate what I call, and it's not in the dictionary, politics, which is the politics of division. And we're seeing that more and more now. That doesn't help the people. We need to bring people together. It can be done, but we may have to miss a generation. Now, you referred to Animal Farm many times. And George Orwell was a prophet, but a prophet of gloom and doom. That book, Animal Farm, was written and published in 1945. The original title of the book was Animal Farm, a fairy story then the publishers decided to drop the mm. latter part of the title. He was a, a gloom merchant. And he was I'm right. not. He, he had, you know, he was trading on fear, not faith. He was right. You know, Neely was wrong. Can I tell you why? <laughs> Look at the sweep of history. It's forward, you know. There are problems, of course, but man is so ingenious, creative, determined, resilient... We always come through the problems, even the COVID thing. We'll learn to live with it like flu. We'll come through this, Neil. There will always be roadblocks, but we come through them. I, we don't give up. I enjoy I, your, you know, he was wrong. I'm sorry, he was wrong. I enjoy wrong. your positivity, although I think, he was, <laughs> I think he was indeed a prophet.